be humble, be curious, be faithful. I have always wished that for myself. And now, as you graduate and to begin a new chapter in your life, I wish that for you. I am very confident that we will come go back to our no normal lives. So what we are seeing is that vaccination, vaccination helps to get a control of this pandemic. It is important, of course, that everyone is getting vaccinated. That will most likely happen in Turkey in the next three to four months, uh, allowing us, allowing us really to to get not only the infections under control but also uh, reduce hospitalization and uh, and continue with our norm normal lives. It is important uh, to. Uh, to consider the learnings uh, from this pandemic, that science and collaboration could make such a big difference. And therefore the optimistic view to the future should be um, that, that, um, that, um, that we invest into, into, into science, invest into education, invest into research and, and stay open for collaborations. We will uh, our research is about helping people and we want to do useful things. And actually our research focus was to develop, to develop medicines for cancer patients and specifically to develop medicines uh, to help individual patients. And what turned out is that, um, that the technology that we have developed is not only able to develop medicines for individual cancer patients, but the same medicine uh, can be used to develop a vaccine which is useful for mankind. So this shows again, it is, it is, uh, it, you can't never expect something. Only thing that you can do is uh, is to stay curious, uh, to uh, to to uh, try to be useful, um, and and if there is an opportunity to help, then be prepared to help. And, and the dimension uh, is, is, does, not, does not play a big role. I feel happy if I can help a single individual, as happy I am that our vaccine help mankind uh, to, to, um, uh, to enable that we can go back to our normal lives. It is the perfect time to ask yourself, what is important to me? Why do I want to get up every morning? How can I contribute to society by fulfilling my dreams? To me, contributing to a certain purpose is what fills me with joy and gratitude. Dedicating my work to improve the health of many. I'm very grateful that we have been able to contribute to, to the fight against this pand pandemic and help so many people with our research and work. Today is your work. Be ready to start a new chapter for you, for your families, and for future generations. First and foremost, make a difference and try to be useful. Many little things can lead to something big. Be humble, be curious, be faithful. I have always wished that for myself. The continued effort that is key to unlock your potential your own superpowers, failing 20 times and succeeding the 21st time. Yes, that is a recurrent theme in yours and my life. Early in my career, I realized that if I want to accomplish something greater, I had to deal with both, with success and with failure. Don't be afraid to fail and don't suffer if you do. Don't waste energy trying to cover up failure. If you are not failing, you are not growing. Be brave, be bold, be humble. Lift each other up, help each other getting the maximum out of yourself and your work. And importantly, celebrate achievements like today's. You have the whole world in front of you. Bursch and I, we cannot wait to see what you do with it. The skills you have developed over the past years will guide you in the future. They will support you in having an impact on science and society. And you are in good company. The historian Jandan Badem, 
The scientists Janan Dadeveren and, and Altuna Akalden and many more alumni from this university have made a difference for society. Early in my career, I realized that if I want to accomplish something greater, I had to deal with both, with success and with failure. Don't be afraid to fail and don't suffer if you do. Don't waste energy trying to cover up failure. If you are not failing, you are not growing. Your moment to shape your generation's world. What you have achieved today. Success and with failure. Don't be afraid to fail and don't suffer 